This is how you can play Magic the Gathering for free. So here's the first thing you want to do. You want to go over to Steam. You want to find a game called Tabletop Simulator. Slap download on this bad boy. It's on sale right now. Not sponsored. Um, it's only 10 bucks. It's stupid cheap. You can pay 10 bucks to play mad any Magic card for free. Once you get that bad boy downloaded, you then want to go to your library. You want to find it. Tabletop Simulator. You want to go to Workshop. And here you can search up a bunch of uh, specific um, modded board games or like on Steam stuff to to play different. So like Crack Pipe Uno, let's not talk about that. Stardew Valley, huh? So you want to find the printer table, which is the one that I have. So this allows you to obviously play Magic the Gathering like in, in any sort of format that, inv that has multiplayer, so EDH, modern, standard. All those formats you got. There's even a whole Discord. The, uh, community that's kind of built around this so I I would encourage to if you don't have friends that don't have this game go check it out but I would just honestly get your friends to play it because it's 10 bucks to play Magic the Gathering for free awesome I'm not gonna go too in-depth on like what like how the UI is because if there's any complaint about it it's that the UI is a little jank but that's to me that's neither here nor there so what you do, you tap create, and if you have a bunch of friends, you can play multiplayer. I'm gonna go single player just to show you this, and then you should have a a um workshop modded thing that says that says um MTG four player table scripted. Click on that bad boy, load, and here you have the beautiful chaos. So there's a few things to um, note, scroll wheel, scroll in and out to zoom in, WASD to move your camera, right click and you can move your mouse even to sort of drag it around. I like it kind of like this, like I'm looking down on the board and then I can zoom in on my stuff, zoom in on other people's stuff. Now, the nice thing about this, we'll start with how to get a deck into the game. Um, you want to come over to, um, you can do this on either side of the table. It should be next to, you'll see it's like an MTG loader bag. You want to find the open importer GUI, which should be on that side and this side. It's on either side of the table. So if we click on this, you can see that it says enter deck list or enter deck list URL. So I have taken a deck list. I'm going to copy paste it here. I'm going to submit, I'm going to take a moment. And if you look over here, you have the deck. So, you also have tokens, which is nice that they just give you those tokens, and if you want, you can then right click, and this is where your favorite menu is gonna be for most cases. So, first of all, important uh, hotkeys to know is, ah, oh, it's R. You want to <laughs> I'm an idiot. You want to tap R to shuffle the deck, and um, you can just do this a few times. Um, of course you're like, but Mr. Rao, there's, yeah, where's your commander? Well, you right click on this bad boy and then you can go to search. No, not reset. Fuck. You want to go to search and um, you just got to know who your commander, commander, commander is. Uh, Turger got a fright, obviously. So you just click her, drag her out, hit F to flip any card. And then you just slap in your command zone. And then you want to drag your deck over here. And then, so, this row, how do you draw cards, you're asking? Well, you just hit, you just hover over the deck and you hit seven cards. All you have to do is hit seven and then it draws all the cards for you. And look at that, I have a soul ring in hand. That's never got, this hand is bananas. This hand is bananas. Regardless, that's how you um you bring in a deck, and you're like, oh man, I this soul ring's ass. Nobody likes soul ring. You hit, you just click on the bad boy, you delete it, you, you delete it, and then you're like, but uh, but I just wanted a black lotus. I actually wanted a black lotus and not a soul ring. So you just type in black lotus, and hit submit on that bad boy. You got yourself. Black Lotus. You can even, like, with a bunch of friends, just play across from each other and play, like, a tournament style. 
You can also, at the importer, I think this is a new thing, you can have a queue. Which is fat. I didn't know that, that, that you could do this. And I, to be young, to be frank, I don't know how this would work. Let me know if y'all want to see, like, a cube draft on it. If you want to see, like, a... Let me know if you want to see any MTG gameplay, because it's been all time since I've played Magic, and I feel like playing some Commander would really be a lot of fun. Maybe even stream it. I don't know. That's how you can play Magic the Gathering for free. If you like the video, please subscribe. And go check out this video <laughs> for MTG, some MTG Arena gameplay, and check out this... <laughs> this playlist for an entire playthrough of MTG Arena. Love y'all, God bless.